coming up, you'll see our favorite two approaches to the classic plot of an impossible location by means of stabbing the pack. Well, thank you, thank you. I want to cut the cards just one time. My, uh, what I'm trying to do is arrange the cards in a situation that's going to be surprising. Now, I'm not sure if I could have, but I made an effort here in my pocket. I have an envelope. And what I'd like you to do is insert the envelope into the deck anywhere you'd like. Okay. Now, there was no way that I could have predicted where she would put that. That's why I try to arrange the cards in a certain way. See, actually, uh, oh, let me show you this. Did you notice here? This is, in fact, my prediction. prediction. <laughs> my prediction. Should have mentioned that a moment earlier, but it is predicting where you would insert that card in the deck. See, the cards are in new wow. deck order. No way. Ace through king, no ace through king, ace through king, ace through king, <laughs> and only one card in the deck is missing. Only one card. Oh, and I you've inserted mean. the envelope right between the two cards, mm -hmm. indicating where one card's missing. Six of spades, eight of spades. And if you'll look inside my envelope, the prediction that I made was, in fact, oh, the seven, seven spades. of spades. Wow. <laughs> But this time, I'd like you to shuffle the cards out of new deck order so that no one can predict exactly where those cards would fall. And I'm going to show you how to stab the pack in a different way with my trusty Ginsu knife. <laughs> you know when they say cut the deck? This is what they're talking about. No, don't worry. This will kill you. This will kill you. <laughs> I'm going to have two cards selected. If you'll pull one out there, and if you'll pull one out as well. Okay. Okay. Any card at all, show it to yourselves as well as to our friends at home. Mm -hmm. Okay, and I'm going to have the cards return together. So let's see, I'll have you return your card. And if you'll return your card, that's the only criteria is that the cards go inside the deck together. Okay, okay? and I want to give the cards a shuffle like this so that there's no way that any of us could tell exactly where those cards would fall. So now the cards are lost down into the center of the deck. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, now, oh, yeah, now he's fancy. <laughs> now I'm going to encircle the deck with this poor man's handkerchief here so that I can't get to the deck to manipulate it in any way. Isolating the cards inside here, all I need now for the dramatic big ending is a drum roll. Okay, if you can all give me a drum roll, please. I'll take the deck and I'll stab. Now, there's no guarantee. Let's take a look here. Now, hopefully, and there's no guarantee, and there's no way to know until the very end, if I have, in fact, found the two selection. What was the name of your card? Jack of Diamonds. And what was the name of your card? The Nine of Clubs. The Nine of Clubs and the Jack of Diamonds. Let's see. Oh. oh. There's the Jack of Diamonds. That's one, but let's make absolutely certain. Yours was... The Nine of Clubs. The Nine of oh. Clubs. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, <laughs>